do with the throat is critical. It's life-threatening. Um, are you okay for me to place my hands on your neck? You will rarely see someone place their hands on, on a neck and go, hey Mary, what's happening? How you going? Okay? Um, usually hands on the neck is more common with women. You see, equally in men, where there's been a scuffle, they end up really close in and then the other one grabs it. In the case of women, hands on a throat is purely about emotion. <laughs> Specifically, it's about rage. If hands are on a woman's throat, you're generally going to see the, 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 the throwing and pushing it. Jesus, I've told you before! How come you didn't cut down it? You see that? It's absolute rage. It's not high how you do them. It's not missy honey. It's rage. For most of us, of average build in this room, once pressure's been applied to both sides of the, 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 the neck, the carotid artery, the vagus nerve, sorry Mary, generally you have around 8 to 10 seconds. For most of us, it's, it's a little less, it's probably 7 to 8 seconds, because the heart rate increases exponentially. You go from a resting rate of around 60 to 70 beats per minute, straight to around 200. At the same time, you expel air out of the lungs, because the, the flight says, <gasps> okay, I'm not going to actually hit it, relax, down the back. Boy, it's a tough audience. Um, <laughs> Um, so you've got maybe eight seconds. So really, really important. So what Mary's going to do here, because you've been waiting to do this whole bloody class, um, is put her hands on my neck. Yeah. And so um, we don't want to make this complicated. Remember we talked about Hicks law? Yeah. Yeah. So this is a classic example. There are two movements. This works in, in on, I can't say it works 100% of the time because I haven't experienced 100% of the time. But this will work against large, tall, strong, skinny, long, short. Okay. Catholic, the whole <laughs> So as the hands come up here, here's the move. Doesn't matter if you're right or left handed, I'm not going to hit you, I'm not going to hurt you. I'm just going to extend my, my right arm in this case, because I'm right handed, straight to the roof. My arm is fully extended, not halfway, it's fully extended. I'm pointing with my index finger to the roof. All I'm going to do now is rotate my right leg over to my left side, and my belly button is going to face the other direction. So for here, apply a little pressure, I'm going to do this slowly. My finger's here. I'm going to rotate my hip and leg the other way, don't let go. And there it is. One clean movement. There are two movements. My arm extends straight to the roof, I point to the roof, I transfer the weight to my left leg, I shuffle my right leg over to the other side and put my belly back. In what does the raised hand um... It allows you to leverage, so it, it's along the theory of fulcrum and levers. It, it allows me leverage. If I only have my hand half extended, I'm fighting it from here as opposed to fighting it from back here, which is this is where all the energy is. The further away from the shoulder I get, the less energy I have in forcefulness. So well, I want to apply energy from much. here. Well, and, and when you're here in a moment, you'll see exactly how. So Mary, I'm going to apply my hands to your throat. You're right-handed. Now I'm not going to apply pressure to the front of the throat. I'm going to give you a little pressure here so you have a sense of what you're experiencing. I'm just going to move that chair because Chances are that's where I'll end up. Take a step to your right. Okay. Um, so, right hand straight to the roof. Now, we're going to do this slowly. Point your finger as best you're capable. Now, you're going to turn to your left and put your right foot over on the other side. When you're ready. Okay. So, so, there it is now. I was giving a little bit of energy and feedback so as not just to let go too easily. Come forward for me. Um, again, hands back to the roof, slowly turn, yep, and keep going. Once you turn, step over, ah, and there it is there. 